Today we'll be looking at the Acer Cloud Mobile S500. It is their latest smartphone in the 1.5 GHz dual core crate range. It offers some very similar specs to the HTC One S. Um, it features a kind of nifty lock screen that uh, we haven't really seen before, which kind of gives you a, a window blind type of view on your home screen. It, as far as customizations go, the Acer offers a few, but not as many as we've seen on, um, on some other smartphones. For instance, uh, your wallpaper settings for the lock screen and home screen can be customized as well as which shortcuts appear on the lock screen, uh, your sound profiles, and the number of home screens, but you don't necessarily are able to add any widgets through this menu. Um, in order to do that, you have to simply go into the widgets menu and drag them onto the home screen from there. As far as the gallery goes, it is the standard uh, one from uh, Ice Cream Sandwich we see our overview of all of our media located on the device. And then going into particular gallery, we can zoom into our photos. And there's also several editing options available, such as effects or saturation levels, etc. The media player um, is pretty standard as well. Uh, it gives you an overview of all of your videos located on your device. We couldn't get it to play a DivX video, but everything else worked pretty well. It's pretty sparse in terms of functionality, but um, it is pretty responsive, especially the scrubber. As far as the music player, you have the same functionality as in the uh, gallery and media player basically a menu of all of your songs, and uh, you, you get to pick which uh, artist you want. There is the ability to slide left and right to go to the next and previous track. And you can also see a playlist of uh, all your upcoming songs as well. And there is Dolby Mobile audio enhancements, which offer a good amount of predefined equalizers, but there is no custom setting. Finally, the web browser, you have your choice of the ICS browser or Chrome. And because this is Android ice cream sandwich and not Jelly Bean, we were able to sideload the Adobe Flash Player APK on here and get some Flash content to work. Again, this device had some very impressive benchmarks, so be sure to check out our review on the Acer Cloud Mobile S500.